Welcome back. We stopped by 9th and Morris in downtown Portland earlier today because this really is an institution in the city when it comes to convenience stores and they closed their doors over the weekend. Doug Peterson is behind this business. 33 years yes. ago, you started here in this exact location. Yes. What's it like to see all this coming to an end? Oh, it, it's sad. <laughs> I really, I, I feel so bad that there was so, not some way that we could save the store during the remodel. Most of the con major constructions on the end of the building, we felt like we could stay open during the construction because, hey, the light rail line is going to be running out here all, the entire time this stop is going to be here. But it didn't work out. It didn't work out. And the city is doing a complete remodel on the right. parking I, structures I, on no either end. to the, uh, the construction. Uh, it needs to be done. The building's old, needs, needs a lot of work. So. But let's talk about the 900 customers you served yes. every day here. Yes. What was that like for all those years? Well, you know, we serve business people. We serve a lot of tourists that are in all the hotels. We're open late at night so that the tourists can come in. Uh, we serve the shoppers, uh, people that live downtown. Basically everybody, construction workers, garbage workers, police, everybody comes in, shops Peterson's. And it's an institution downtown. And we know, Doug, that there was an effort as we move through the store. Let's take a walk over here and meet your daughter, Jennifer, because those customers who were so loyal over the years, you see all these things being packed up as they close this final day. The loyal customers, they sort of banded together. And Jennifer, you're standing here with a stack of petitions that you presented to the city. I mean, thousands of people wanted to save this store. Yes, thousands of people. We presented it to um, the city council several times, Prosper Portland, and they just, there was no response. And I mean, thousands and thousands of customers. I mean, we've been here for 33 years and you know, it's, um, it's really hard, it's really hard. Very tough for you because you grew up here with your dad and you learned a great work ethic. Your first job? Yes, it was my first job. Um, <laughs> I uh, recycled the cans and bottles and that's what I did and I cleaned and uh, you know, and eventually started helping customers and customer service, you know, tourists, um, you know, everyone that comes through here is, you know, uh, family really, you know. Well, you know, Doug, I'll bring you back into the conversation. People say, oh, a convenience store. You know, I get a soda, maybe a bag of chips once in a while, but I get the sense that this became very much a family for you. Oh, yes, and, and you know, it's the customers that come in, they've been coming for years, and I, we have people that say, well, I came in as a kid, and now I'm shopping as an adult, and uh, they just can't see why it's closing and why they, they really need us. and. Uh, we, we serve a need and uh, it's kind of a icon downtown, kind of like uh, Starbucks, uh, Powell's Books or uh, Voodoo Donuts, you know, everybody knows Peterson's. Well, very much so and nice to see you going out with a smile still on your face and that may be because you have three other locations in downtown Portland so you can continue to support Peterson's Convenience Store. All the best to you and thanks for sharing your story with us today. Thank you.